hi everyone welcome back to my channel dna art today i will be showing you in this video how i made these hearts and i call them healing hearts and these days these are very famous on facebook and people are also making pocket hugs as well so these these may be a beautiful gifts for this valentine day or any other day for someone very special so let's start i have taken these molds and i have worked very many times with this mold heart molds and these are quite famous and liked by everyone and i like these heart shapes as well so starting with the first layer of resin and this is because I, these will be done in layers the reason behind is that i don't want the flowers and the other embellishment to float so it will be done in different parts so this is the first layer and I will be adding these mushrooms. You can actually add whatever you like, but I like to make them magical. Here I'm adding the moss, it's been dried. And I'm trying to make a fairy garden theme heart and representing a knight so this is all about thinking and imagination and to whom are you are giving this heart what does they like so it's really up to you so i might be adding lots of gold flakes glitter and shells so you can see as i go so here i'm adding these real flowers and these are also called straw flowers and these these butterflies are by moth and magic i really love their butterflies and their moths and they are so real lifelike and here i am just choosing the butterfly i like to put in according to my color theme and these are pixie stools these came all the way from scotland i ordered them from etsy so there are a lot of things that i'm adding have came from different places so that make these hearts more magical and that's why i call them healing hearts so you can make these and these are special gifts
and this layer has been done so we'll meet you next day for the second layer so this is the next second day and my first layer has been cured for the center one i will be backing it with the black resin because as i explained before it will be going to be a night time fairy garden theme so i will be adding the black And now I'm pouring the second layer and the second layer is a bit of thin layer because I will be adding few things in the second layer. These are aura flakes that I'm just cutting up and adding to the heart because at different levels they will set up and this will create an illusion and just like uh, the things are suspended in the heart. If I pour them in one go, they might jumble up and it will look like a rough heart. So with these layers, I like them to adjust as I like the embellishment to look. So I'm adding the moss here. These little hearts and botanical decoration do take time because i really don't want to make them a bit messy or something like this so that's why we have to work in layers so everything you can see in an in a heart or any shape you like these to be molded they have to be seen in clear layers A lot of time everyone asks me that I buy a lot of crystals, what I do with them. So as you can see, I add them to my crystal, my resin uh, creations as well. And after using them in these resin creations, I do make some jewelry pieces as well. If you have gone back, you can see some of my soft soul ring videos. I do make jewelry with them as well. And I'm a collector as well. I like to keep uh, the rare crystals or the pieces that I can't get again because each crystal piece is just one of a kind taken from the earth sensibly and ethically so here I'm pouring the final layer this is the third day and this might be my final um, if you can see I have added a little mool in the small heart and now I'm just adding a hint of alcohol inks just to give it more dimension. You can omit this step as well, but if you like to add more inks, you can add more inks. It's just really a you know a play thing. And with this, my healing hearts are all done and we let them to cure. So see you next day. This is the next day. And this is how this one turned out. I really like the black in the background. It really popped all the mushrooms and botanical items. So this is the smaller one. And here is the one with the butterfly. 
and this one I made on the side I thought I'll just add it so these are the final pictures of these hearts and I hope you like them I really enjoy making these they are a bit of therapeutic as well it's just me and the reason when we have when we are connected and do give it a try these are really fun and magical to make and once you get addicted to them you can't stop that i can see you for the sure so until for the next time you take care and 